The Fakur and the Sigil became even better, guys. Yes, one of the best missiles of the game in BVR just became better. Um, now they turn 20 Gs and they pull a little bit more AOA on their fin. So, yeah, scary missile. Let's test it out a little bit. Flying with the F-14 from Iran. On one of my favorite aircraft of the game for sure, uh, especially right now. Uh, this BR of this aircraft is crazy that it's it's like that. But yeah, let's let's start to fire our beloved Fakurs. I need targets that are flying kinda in the same direction as I am. Mm. This target is trying to climb a little bit. We gotta keep updating uh, the targets, of course, until our missiles go active. One of them went active already. Two of them went active. Uh, this one missed. Oh no, it went active as well. That's weird. And the last one. Come on. Why are you not going? At yeah. Last one active as well. So let's see. One of them is hit. I think we missed two of them. Um, going close to the ground probably. And I think this is gonna hit as well. Yeah. So technically we're gonna see two targets. I can fire a sigil onto this one. And the sigil is also turning 20 Gs now guys. But it's obviously a semi-active radar homing missile. So, yeah, we got two kills there. Two of them probably went, um, went to the ground and I missed because of that. But yeah, this one probably will hit if the target doesn't do anything, which he's, he's not doing. And I gotta say, there's no reason to not why use the, the Sigil, right? I mean, it's just a, such a good missile that there's no reason why not. Like, the R27R is it's pretty fun, but... I mean, the sigil, man, is the sigil. It's kind of, it's kind of too good on the speed and other departments to not be included here. Um, we need some locks. This is a problem. That guy. Very close range shot. Uh, the missile will not have too much time to actually gain energy but yeah another kill these missiles are crazy good man like oh my god this is one of my favorite uh the smt of course was my favorite and the su-27 but i gotta say with the the, the facors man i can do what i really love doing which is bvr i love bvr right and with this thing i can i can just do BVR very, very well. And... Aim 9 kill, of course. And the first game on this aircraft and I already have an ace. This thing needs a new BR, man, I think. Like, it's kind of... <laughs> it's still at 12.3, right? It's still at 12.3. And, like, it has... I mean, I wish... I honestly am saying this. I wish I had, like, four Fakurs in my SU-27 just to help out just to help out maybe one or two just to help out because i honestly believe that these missiles are better than most bvr missiles that we see just because of the sheer energy and speed that the missile has it's crazy man it really is oh my god but yeah five kills let's try to get at the last one i think it's yeah this last guy there let's get a six kill game shall we oh no Oh my god, almost killed me. I don't have flares. Well, maneuver Q. <laughs> I was the closest one. <laughs> but yeah, guys, uh, let's get to another one. One more with this thing. But yeah, guys, I just want to wrap it up. I don't want this video to be too long. But uh, yeah, you can go and check it out if you go here. Uh, that it's actually pulling the 20 Gs that I told you guys about. See? Uh, so yeah, for shorter ranges, for sure, the R27 will be better. But to be honest, just use these missiles for long range. You already get two, four kills, I don't know. So it kind of doesn't, like, 
it doesn't matter too much. Even if you, we go to the missile guided weaponry data made by uh, Kopani over here, you can see the Fakur is this one. Look at the amount of energy initially that the Phoenix of all missiles have compared to the Fakur, for example. And if you take a look, most of the stuff will be very similar in a general sense, right? But if you go look to maximum Phoenix uh, lateral acceleration, you see that it's higher than the Phoenix. Uh, the maximum fin angle of attack is higher than the Phoenix. And of course, as I said, the G, I mean, it's more for the stat card, but maximum G, 20 Gs compared to the 17. It was 15 before the buff, uh, which is, you know, it's a big buff. It's a 5G, it's one fourth of a buff, if you think about it. So, yeah, it's... It's good, guys. So if you have the, the Iranian F-14, go out there and test the new missiles because it's just pretty amazing. I wish I had these missiles in more aircraft. But yeah. See ya, guys. Bye. Subscribe.